Oh, and speaking of wonderful, there is something going on that is uh, more than wonderful, especially if you are a collector. Yeah. And there's a show that started yesterday, but there's a big auction that's going to be today and tomorrow, mm -hmm. and it should be really easy to find. It's right across from the airport over at the Holiday Inn uh, inside that dome area, which is kind of cool. Uh, but this is something that you really want to pay attention to because if you are a fan of gas pumps and things like that, this is perfect, Jackie. And uh, they're so popular. Oh, my gosh, yes. If you watch the Picker Show or anything yep. like that, they're mm -hmm. always looking for these items. So we have the experts in studio with us right now to talk a little bit more what this is all about. We have Kevin Parker and also Taylor Smith joining us. And you, you're the guys that are... Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, talk fast. Tell us about your company and where you guys are from. Uh, our company's name is Route 32 Auctions. Okay. We're out of uh, Crawfordsville, Indiana, okay. just out of the side of the Indy metro area. Mm -hmm. um, we're the beginning of the corn country, so... All right. But uh, yeah, we've been in business uh, for a few years now, and uh, we specialize in antique Petroliana advertising. Petroliana Seriously? advertising. Yes. Yeah. You can get that specific when yep. it comes to auctioneers. Yeah, That's amazing. For, yes. So this, this is gas pumps and, and, and oil-related products? Gas and, and pumps, things. neons. Neon, too. Okay. Signs. Neon. Like Signs, yes, exactly. So how popular is this? It is very popular. It's a it's the fastest. I would say the fastest growing hobby in the nation right now. Really, if not the world. Collecting collect petrol stuff. Collecting petrol stuff. Do, do yeah. we know wow. why? Do we know why this is so popular? Uh, you know, I think it's um, it takes pe people back to their childhood. Yeah. You yes. know, I tell people I was born in the wrong generation. I'm a little young for this stuff. I don't remember it, but I love it. You know, it's it's. You know, it's it's a fun thing to do. You can, you know, display it and just sit and enjoy it. You know, that's the best part. Yeah, so, absolutely. Yeah, yeah. So basically, it says anything that has to do with petroleum type products. For this, auction, for this auction, for this yeah. auction okay. specifically, this is gas and oil related. Gas yeah. and oil okay. related. Okay, so give us related. an example. So we were talking yeah. about this one on our Great Things Happening calendar. You just had everything set out and displayed yesterday. Correct. The yeah. physical auction yes. starts today. Starts yeah. today at 2 o'clock, mm -hmm. and we'll run 308 lots. That will run until approximately 6, 37 o'clock tonight. Yeah. All right. Where is this stuff coming from? Like, it, are, are people going to Iowa Barnes and being like, oh, hey. <laughs> well, that's, that's part of what we do behind the scenes. Yeah. Um, we get to go out and see a lot of collections, dig through barns barns and buildings and facilities. And now, uh, you're in Indiana. Where's yeah. the best picking at? All over the nation. All over? It, and it's really? geographic. There's different things in uh, the West Coast, and there's different things in the East Coast. For example, what do you mean? Well, like this piece here. Uh, this is what we call a neon sign. This is a PDQ. Uh, a very hold, rare piece. Hold this up here. Okay, yeah. they got it. They got, yeah. it. got it. Okay, there you go. Yeah. Okay, we'll and uh, this okay. came out of the West Coast. This was a West Coast oil company back in the early 1900s. Uh, very rare piece. You can go to the East Coast, and they had East Coast oil companies. I was going to say, here in the Midwest, that doesn't look familiar, but it's Absolutely. part it's of that collection that you would probably really yeah. enjoy. And the biggest thing with this, it's a very rare piece. Okay. Uh, I think we only, know of, we only know of three known. There's right. a few others out there. All right, so what would something like this go for? Seventy-five to 100000 It's Whoa, 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 whoa. How much? Seventy-five to 100000 How big is this thing? Does the neon work? The neon yeah. works? Okay. Yeah. Wow. I was like, <laughs> working better better work that. maybe better be working if you <laughs> plug it in. What sign is this? Yeah, how, how big is it? That's approximately, when it's all put together, about six foot tall. Oh, yeah. it's, it's a big, it's like a on big top one. of a building type sign. Uh, it in would, front of a building. It was actually would be on a pole. Okay. And it was two-sided, so as you was going down the road, it caught your attention. Is this at here? Yep. This is here. Yeah, it's on display at uh, at the Holiday Inn. Oh, wow. And yeah. you're planning on selling that here? Yes, this will sell tomorrow night, or tomorrow afternoon, actually. Really? Yes. All yeah. right. It'll no. be very exciting. So yeah. this is West Coast stuff, and you, you guys are from the Midwest. Oh, what yes. kind of stuff are you finding in the Midwest that might be appealing to, to people around here? It's it's uh, all the same stuff, just different oil companies. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Like Sinclair, Sinclair's very popular. You see the, the green, you see the dinosaur. Absolutely. People get excited. And Sinclair's yeah. actually coming back. You see yeah. a lot of Sinclair stations popping up now, right. new stations. Yes, so I, I see a revitalization of the Sinclair products coming back. Now, does that help you in the auction in, on the auction side? Some of the older stuff, since they're oh, starting to become more prominent. Absolutely, again? that brings in the younger generation and gets right. them excited. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So we have your website up, and it was kind of rotating some pictures there yes. of like pumps and, there, yes. and lights and things like that. Yes. Is that what we can experience if we that, head out to the Holiday yeah, Inn? That's exactly. What yep. you this is actually our showroom back in Crawfordsville, Indiana, but these are the same products, products. that we will be yeah. selling here at this auction. Now, uh, at the auction, can you just get the tops, some of the, the yes, glass yeah. tops? Yes, absolutely. Okay, not instead of getting the whole pump? Absolutely. It's okay. all broke down. But obviously, it all depends on who's interested in the product with an auction, but yes. I can't afford a $100,000 sign. Yeah, we have but all price ranges. You do? Yes. Okay, because yeah. I do have uh, friends and family that are enthusiasts this way and love seeing, yes. you know, 
the Sinclairs and the things like that. So if I exactly. came down, I'd probably be able to find. You can you participate know, and have a lot of fun. Oh, so, I love it. And the energy will be second to none. So let's talk about if I just want to come and watch or just see the oh, array yeah. of things that are available. Highly Is that possible? It. Yeah, you're going to come and you're going to see pieces that you can't see anywhere else. You know, the common folk, they don't have the time to go out in the barns and dig around and do, do auctions weekly like we do. Right. So this is a great place to see a lot of product in one location. All right, Taylor, what, what are some of the other things? And we're talking about the gas pumps and the, and the globes on top yeah. and things like that. What other type of actual things will you be auctioning off um, besides the neon signs, things that are really expensive? What, what's more reasonable? Uh, porcelain signs, tin signs. I mean, Tin signs, yeah, okay. Tin, painted tin. Um, you know, there's a range from, there's some oil cans that are $100 and like Kevin said, up to $100,000 for that sign. So, you know, um, there's probably 200 oil cans today that will sell. You're actually auctioning off oil yeah. cans. Yeah. Really? I mean, yeah, yeah. there's some Who's that thought? are worth six, $7,000 for <laughs> oh, an oil really? can. Oh, yeah. really? Okay. So yeah. let's say I want to jump in on this new hobby that's so oh hot. Yes. What should I be looking for? How do I know this piece is only worth $100 compared to the one that might be worth seven grand? That's, that's a toughie. That comes with years of experience or someone like me and Kevin, you know, to network with, to call and ask. But um, there's fakes out there that are meant to deceive. I mean, that's that's a big part of what we have to look for are fakes. I mean that, and you know, they they slip through the cracks. I mean, it happens. So, um, you know, basically experience, um, but. Um, it, it's it's hard to say. There are several different variables to to know if something. This real. is something absolutely fascinating that, much, yeah. that you actually can auction off. You mentioned the oil can. I have an old STP bottle with Richard Petty's uh, face on. Is that yeah. worth anything? Uh, not yet. And not yet. yet. <laughs> <laughs> Hang on to put it. Put it, it, put it away for a while. Okay. They'll, they'll come pick that in another yeah. few years. Yes. Uh, because you're out there, you're doing the groundwork, you're doing the research. Do you have any fun stories you can share with us this morning of oh something that sticks gosh. out in your mind oh. that would kind of relate to? <laughs> what so people many. can experience uh there's there's just so many uh, meeting the people in the hobby is just that's probably the most pleasure that we get i mean doing what we do is a lot of fun but meeting the folks and learning and hearing their stories and the history behind their collection i mean there's there's men and women that that take this and that's their vacations that's their lifestyle really absolutely and they've been doing this 30 40 50 years wow yeah and, and hearing impressive. them dragging their children on vacation to gas shows and yep. buying and that's what they did so it, it's actually for a lot of people it's a lifestyle yeah yeah it's bring back a lot of memories a lot of memories a lot of people and again yes. that's going on today and tomorrow today and tomorrow okay and tell everybody where at the Holiday Inn Airport. Yep. It starts at 2 o'clock this afternoon. We'll run to about 637, and then tomorrow we start at 9 a.m. in the morning. That is okay, awesome. Okay, bright and early. Right, but if you that, want that sign. That, that Pelican, you, you have an extra 100 grand laying around. You want tomorrow. that big Pelican sign. You have it available, and you're going to be auctioning it off. What time is this one going? That'll be mid-afternoon. Mid-afternoon yeah. mm -hmm. tomorrow. You yep. have to put that right up in front of your house. Everybody That's know where right. you live. That's Absolutely. Right. Okay. Yes. That is oh. awesome. Gentlemen, thank you yeah. so much. This Thanks is so for having us. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Thank you. That's incredible. Thank you.